yo what's going on everyone welcome back to my youtube channel in today's video i'm gonna be showing you guys all of the best money methods you can be doing this week to make yourself millions of dollars in gta 5 online and in total i'm gonna show you guys five different money methods that everybody watching will be able to do because i'd say around half of these money methods you don't even need requirements for and you can still make a lot of money and also rp off of this so if you guys do go on to enjoy today's video, definitely do me a favor, go down below and drop a like. Also hit that subscribe button if you guys are new around here. We're coming up very close to 300,000 subscribers, so every single subscribe will definitely help us get closer to that goal. But now, let's get into the very first money method. Okay, so getting into the first money method, we're going to be doing the HSW time trial. And if you guys do not know where the HSW time trial is located this week, I'm going to show you guys right now on the map. You can see it's going to be located right here on the map. So make your way over to this exact location. You guys know these HSW time trials come out once every single week. And it's for sure something you do not want to ignore because you can make a lot of money off this in just around, I don't know, anywhere from one to two minutes, depending on how long the time trial is. In this case, it's only one minute and 47 seconds long. Once you guys get your fast HSW, vehicle though go up to the time trial click right d-pad to start it and just open up your pause menu now go over to where the checkpoint is at which is over here and mark it that way you have a checkpoint to get there now drop your pause menu open up your phone click right here where it says job list then click x and then a to quit the time trial from here now all you're going to want to do is line yourself up like this so you're able to click right d-pad to start the time trial and whenever you guys are ready simply click right on the d-pad to start it and now you're just going to want to try to be as fast as possible while also trying not to crash as much as possible because of course if you do crash you're not going to beat it and yeah as long as you do both of those things and you make it to the destination in time you guys will end up beating it and i'm gonna show you guys right now how much money you actually end up getting paid and you can actually see right here i actually wrecked at the very end i would have been so mad if i didn't beat this time trial on my first try because i don't know why but time trials are the only thing in gta that make me so mad when i don't beat them the first try i don't know why but anyway once you do beat it you guys will be getting paid two hundred and fifty thousand dollars. and of course you can only do this once every single week that's why i always include it in my money method video but now getting into the second money method we're going to be doing the moc missions so of course you will need a mobile operations center in order to do this and you're just going to want to go inside your mobile operations center come up to this little touch screen click right d-pad and then you guys will be in the mission section for all of the moc missions you guys can see these are all going to be paying triple money and triple rp this entire week so go ahead and start up whichever one of these you guys want to i'm just going to start up the one right here called work dispute but if you guys want to start up another one feel free to but the work dispute one in my opinion is pretty easy as long as you have one other person who knows what they're doing of course in all these missions make sure you guys set the difficulty set to hard that way you get paid 1.5 times more money which is not that much more but hey i mean if it's if it's money you're looking for that's what you're gonna want to do set it on hard anyway yeah this mission that i'm doing right now is pretty simple all we really did is drop down from our cargo plane come down destroy every single enemy that we saw here including helicopters and then we had to destroy an moc that was starting to run away on a highway and after we did that that was literally it all in all i think it took right around five minutes to do this mission but one thing that i forgot to mention is at the beginning of the mission you should be going on your phone in real life and setting a stop watch that way you know how long you've been in the mission for because you're going to want to be in this mission for a total of 15 minutes and you guys are probably wondering why do you have to be in this mission for 15 minutes if it's only five minutes long and the answer to that is because once you're in these missions for 15 minutes that's actually going to give you the max amount of money that missions in gta could possibly give you so of course you're going to want to try to max out the most money you guys can get out of these missions because of course i'm assuming you guys are doing this to make a lot of money so chances are going to be super high that you guys are going to finish the mission earlier than 15 minutes. So if it does come down to that, just go up to the drop off point or wherever the destination point is for you in the mission and just wait there until your stopwatch hits 15 minutes or until you've been in the mission for 15 minutes. If you guys were keeping track, once you guys are in the mission for 15 minutes, though, now you can just go up to the destination and then just finish the mission. And now you'll be getting paid the max amount of money, which is going to be this amount right here. You can see you guys will be getting paid around fifty nine thousand dollars, almost six thousand dollars and a total of ten thousand rp so this is definitely going to be a good money method and also rp method if you guys don't have that much stuff in the game all you need to do this is an moc 
All right, but now getting into the third money method, we're going to be doing the time trial for this week, which is going to be getting us $100,000 in less than a minute 40 seconds. And if you guys do not know where the time trial is located at for this week, it's going to be located over here at the top of the map. So make your way over here. And once you guys are over here, call out your fastest motorcycle that you guys own. This can be a Shitaro, a Kucho drag bike, or any fast motorcycle that you guys own. Once you guys get it though, come up to the time trial, click right D-pad to start it. Don't go nowhere. Just open up your pause menu and then come over here to where the check point is at and then just go ahead and mark it that way we have a waypoint to get there now drop your pause menu open up your phone click right here where it says job list and then click x and then a to quit the time trial now all you're going to want to do just like the hsw time trial we just did just come up to it and then have the option to click right d-pad once you guys have that option to click right d-pad like this you're now simply going to want to click right on the d-pad whenever you guys are ready to start it oh you I don't even know what I did there. I guess I jumped the gun a little bit early, but yeah, just click right D-pad whenever you guys are ready and just do the time trial just as normal. Now, this time trial isn't tricky, but you do have to be very fast and there is no room for error. So you have to be basically perfect and also going max speed the entire way through. So in order to do that, make sure you guys are holding RC all the way down and also your left joystick all the way up. Once you guys make it all the way to the destination though, and if you beat it, here's how much money you end up getting paid, right around 101000 dollars which is very good for only one minute and 38 seconds but yeah now let's get into the fourth money method all right so this next money method in order to do this you need to simply open up your pause menu and then come over here to where it says online now come over to where it says quick join then go down to play job go down to rockstar created then go down to stunt races you guys can see if you scroll down all of these stunt races are going to be paying triple money and triple rp you guys know a lot of people are bored with gta but this is the one week where if you guys are bored with gta this is going to be a good week for you guys to actually start playing because in my opinion stunt races are very fun anyway for the race type make sure you set that to non-contact put the number of laps set to seven and then come down to destroy last place and put that to 60 seconds now a lot of people might not like the fact that i put destroy last place every 60 seconds but trust me that's going to make the race as short as possible and it's also going to give you guys the most amount of money these are just the best settings to run when you guys are doing stunt races and i'm pretty sure everybody here knows what are the fast cars to choose when doing a stunt race but my personal opinion the divestiate the creep and also the uh what's it called the itali rsx those are all three vehicles that you guys should be choosing from if you do own them if you don't own any fast vehicles it's completely fine to just choose one of the stock vehicles but just keep in mind if you're going up against people with upgraded kriegers itali rsx's or even a divesti 8 those people will end up having a slight advantage on you guys when doing these races but don't worry you're just going to want to try your best and try to come in either first second or third place because those are going to be the positions that will be paying the most money in rp while doing these stunt races you guys already know all my loyal subscribers here who've been watching me for a minute you guys know stunt races is my strong suit in gta 5 online i almost always come in first place sometimes second place not gonna lie but i have more wins than losses anyway let's just go ahead and skip straight to it i'm gonna show you guys how much money in rp you guys get every single time you do one of these races and i've only been in this race for nine minutes keep that in mind nine minutes and this is how much money in rp i'm about to get right here once the race finishes you can see i just got first place and here's how much money in rp you can see i got paid sixty six thousand dollars which is very good for only nine minutes and look at the rp nineteen thousand rp that is absolutely insane. If you guys do the math right there, you're going to be getting 19,000 RP every single nine minutes. So you could literally level up hundreds of levels doing these stunt races. So definitely make sure you guys take advantage of it while you guys can this week. And speaking of things you should take advantage of this week, the number one thing you're going to want to take advantage of when it comes to making money with your friends is going to be the CEO VIP work. If you guys do not know, CEO VIP work is going to be paying triple money or no, double money, my bad, double money and double rp this entire week if you guys go to your ceo and your interaction menu come over here to vip work and start up any one of these they're going to be paying double money and double rp you can see i'm going to be starting up the headhunter one which is the one that i recommend you guys start up as well because it's probably one of the easiest ones and it also pays a really good amount of money it only takes like i don't know maybe one to two minutes if you guys have a full ceo and all of the people in your ceo are going to be getting paid the exact same amount as well 
So if you and your friends want to help each other out, get some money and grind money this week, this is for sure going to be the best way. I think I've already said that like three times. Basically, why I keep saying it is because you should take advantage of it. Anyway, here's how much money you get once you do one of these headhunter jobs or any one of the VIP works. You can see I got paid $41,000. Like I said, this should take you no longer than three minutes to complete. And there is a cooldown. I think it's like a 10 minute cooldown. So in between this, what I recommend you guys do is just do one of the VIP works and then do a VIP challenge most of the time when you finish that vip challenge the cooldown will be over for the vip work and then you can just simply start up another headhunters and just keep repeating that cycle grinding money anyway let's go ahead and get into the very last money method in today's video and since I do this in almost every single my money methods, I'm pretty sure you guys already know what I'm going to be talking about. And that's going to be the brand new RC Bandito time trial for this week. If you guys do not know where it's located, it's going to be located right here at the Vespucci Canals. So make your way over here to this location, come up to the time trial and click right on the D-pad to start it. As soon as you guys start it, all I recommend you guys doing with this RC Bandito time trial is just to take your time and try not to crash more than two times. As long as you guys do those two things, you should be able to beat it. And once you beat it, here's how much money you end up getting getting paid you can see you get paid a total of one hundred and one thousand dollars which is really good for only a minute and 40 seconds of doing a simple rc bandito time trial but anyway like i said that's going to be the last money method in today's video hopefully you guys did go on to enjoy and as you guys can probably hear my voice sadly again i am sick man it's so annoying like i've been getting sick every single weekend for the past three weeks and if you guys are wondering why it's because i've been going out to a lot of parties yes your boy Fresh has been going out to a lot of parties and sadly I suffer the consequences of getting sick but I'm getting really good and feeling better right now I should be good by tomorrow so hopefully in my next videos I do sound a little bit more normal anyway hope you guys did go on to enjoy today's video if you guys did go on to enjoy definitely do me a favor go down below drop a like and also hit that subscribe button that's it for me I'll see you guys in my next video peace